Folks, the clock is ticking. Only 34 days left until Election Day, and Jefferson County needs more people to work the polls. Lots of the usual volunteers have opted out because of COVID concerns. Tonight, 12 News reporter Victoria DeLeon shares how you can help, and also more on the changes that you may find at the polls. With less than two weeks away from the start of early voting, uh, we could not do it without the volunteers that we do have. Jefferson County has about 55% of poll workers confirmed to volunteer. So we expected that we would have a lot of people that may not be able to work this election, and we certainly understand. Jefferson so County Clerk Carolyn Guidry says the average poll worker is over 65, putting them at high risk for COVID-19. With COVID precautions and the possibility of not having enough volunteers, your time at the polls may take longer than usual. We're beefing up. We're doing what we can. So to help cut down the time you spend there, you're encouraged to pick up a sample ballot, fill it out ahead of time, and bring it with you to the polls. But what if you're voting by mail? Over 9,000 ballots was mailed out the day before yesterday. Don't hold that ballot. Fill it out when you get it and put it in the mail. Oh, There's been a lot of back and forth with the voting process as a whole, but Gidry hopes that well, doesn't discourage know people. That, you know, every vote counts. We want everybody to take part in this very uh, important election. In Jefferson County, as of Wednesday, over 148,000 people are registered to vote. Getting to 150,000 puts the county at 83% of eligible voters registered. Jefferson County Tax Assessor Allison Getz says they're expecting to surpass the numbers from 2016 when 149,000 people were registered. But please do take advantage of your rights. And if you have some time, we'll take you. We need poll workers. <laughs> to volunteer, you can visit the Jefferson County Elections website. There's no deadline, and Carolyn says they could use the help. In Beaumont, Victoria De Leon, 12 News.